I'm Leah Gelvin, I'm the State Manager for Eatwell Tasmania. I think we can all agree that Tasmania produces the best food in the world. In the last 12 months, we've been looking at local food procurement and the opportunity that it might present for us here in Tasmania. When we looked at the evidence from overseas, what we discovered is that it's good for jobs, it's good for local and regional economies, it increases access to fresh, healthy food, and also crucially gives us an opportunity for how to address climate change. So beyond the evidence from overseas, we've also been talking to people in Tasmania. I'm Amy, I'm from Southern Fields. I run this business with my partner, Ben, and we grow lettuce and brassicas for the Tasmanian wholesale and supermarkets. I guess we want Tasmanians to have the freshest possible food. And if it's seasonal and it's fresh and it's grown in Tasmania, you're guaranteed that it's going to have a better nutrient content and less chemicals will have been applied to it. Our business is based on the Tasmanian market and we sell 99% of our produce to the local Tasmanian market. The part that allows us to do that is that we have a reliable market for our produce. Without the market and the local market, we're not going to think about putting it in the ground. So my name's Jamie McLaughlin. I'm the General Manager of Southern Food Service. I've been in the food service industry for 17 years. So we're a Tasmanian owned and operated wholesale food service distributor. We specialise in wholesale fruit and veg. When we're producing our product internally, we're very mindful of waste. So if any offcuts that we get from producing our, in our factory here, we turn those into A-grade products. Uh, we've been able to build fantastic relationships with local growers. You can't do that on the mainland, you can't go to the mainland every week. So that is the advantage of being able to buy locally. If we're sending Tasmanian fruit and veg to the mainland, it's a missed opportunity as far as I'm concerned for jobs. If you keep the product here, it can be sold locally through wholesalers, which employs pickers, packers, drivers, logistics people. There's heaps of people that would love to be doing this work. Well, I'm quite positive on, on the future. I think our business will only go from strength to strength. Um, and I think that it's starting to change. There is a real push and demand for locally produced products. I'll come and grab them and put them in the basket. Yeah. So my name's Ainsley Wagner. I'm the executive chef at Government House. At Government House we use Tasmanian fruit and veg in every single meal. Well, the benefits of sourcing Tasmanian fruit and veg is the fact that because it's locally, locally produced, it means that it's a lot more affordable for families and for the general public. It's a lot more affordable for restaurants. And I think a lot of restaurants really want to showcase our Tasmanian produce because it is right up there. It is some of the best quality in the world. We shouldn't have to push the barrow so much. It should be just everyday life and that we should have it all. Buy Tasmanian, we want Tasmanian and we deserve it. Well, we all deserve to eat fresh, beautiful produce. And we live in a state where we have beautiful water and beautiful soils. And to ship all of our fresh produce out and then to bring produce that has to go through treatments to get back on our shelves, it's, um, it's like selling our, our souls a little bit. <laughs> Tasmanian fruit and veg is the best um, and our customers expect that now. So we don't want to go to the mainland, we want to buy everything locally. Local food procurement makes it easier for businesses and institutions to buy more Tasmanian food. We want the state government to strengthen the rules around local food procurement. We want leadership and we want resourcing because we know it's great for our economy, for jobs, for our health and the environment. We want it for Tasmania.